How's it going, everybody? Late night push here just past 1 a.m. Let's see if we can get this second main course done by 3. That would be good for me. We can get it done by 3, then I can do the Valiant case. That's a nice quick one, and then we'll be on our way. I'll do all the randoms for the giveaways and stuff tomorrow once I get back in the store, get a little sleep, get a little rest, etc., etc. So, first leg of main course draft 400. This is 13 and 14, just a box of 13 and a case of 14 jumbo. After this, we got a 15 draft super jumbo case, half case 16, super jumbo, and then 17 and 18 draft That'll be a fun one. There's a lot of big names in that. I think Nolan Gorman's in 18 draft, and I was incorrectly stating 18 Bowman because I'm an idiot. It is tomorrow for me already. Yep. <laughs> Here we go. Good luck, guys. We'll begin with the solo 13 draft. Obviously, this is a big one. We've been putting packs in Rookie P for many, many months now. Our stock has dwindled down. This is one of our last boxes. This may actually be our last box. I don't remember if we have one more up there or not. I think I see one. I think it was back. I talked to Tim Laker when they sent Malik's out, and I asked Tim what they were trying to get him to work on. Fastballs on Amazon Prime. Beautiful. Good stuff. I have me my Amazon Prime, so I'll be able to watch it. Okay. 13 draft. He said he started to work at it. Woo. Eastern, Central. Let's see, you're in Chicago, so Central, right? Yeah, that ain't going to be fun, man. Okay, Meyer. Fernandez, rookie. Kyle Crick, refractor. Jock Peterson, first Bowman there. Vogelbach, Springer, not his first, though. Kaminsky and Ott. Oh, come on, man. Why can't we ever get any suspense with these older Bowman boxes? Travis Demery to kill the autograph suspense right in the beginning. Texas Rangers. Ah, uh, Rays and Rangers off the board with a Travis Demery. Okay, let's see if we can pull some judges or some bonus action here. Willie Medina, Hagen Miller, Barnes, Avila, and Nick Franklin. Who am I looking for, Preston? Let's see, you said pull me some fire. What do you got? Oh, I'm looking at the wrong screen. Yeah, I should probably look at that screen. St. Diago. You're looking for Hunter Renfro, man. Salazar. Nice Almora. Buxton in there, too. Mark Montgomery. We do have a refractor peeking out. Well, Johnny Gray Mini. Zunino Rookie. Buxton. We got a Futures game. Boy, both are Bowman boxes tonight. Older ones both have these. Raymond Fuentes. All-Star Future Games 2012. 74 out of 99 for the Padres. There you go, Preston. Hot fire. Raymond Fuentes. Where is Raymond Fuentes now? Let's play a little game. I'm remodeling. Uh, Blanton and Gonzalez. That will not count off the uh, off the skunk board. Not an auto, and it's not chrome. And it's not low numbered. What about him? Home theater. He's amazing. Honestly, expert does do justice. And you? Smart home. I did not watch the Ted Williams doc either. <laughs> Probably will wind up checking that out at some point, though. Don't be late to watch Boom! Oh, what the hell with the center in, though? I'll be going to the com C point of one John Crowder. Nice Judge Chrome, unless you want to try for the PSA 10 off center. That would uh, that'd be a stretch, though. That's that's bad. Way off left to right, super far off top to bottom. But it is the first Judge Chrome we've seen in a long, long time. Nice card, man. Judge first Chrome, 13 Bowman. Uh, he's not in the room, Preston. Feel free to PM him on Facebook if you want to try, though. He usually just sends that stuff to ComC, though. Nice Gaddis rookie. For the lockdown. 
Green Chrome, is that Sanchez? Damn. Gary Sanchez, nice card, 35 out of 75. I think that's his second Chrome. Obviously, his first was 2010. I don't think he reappeared until now, 2013. Could be wrong, maybe he was in 11 and 12. 35 out of 75 on the Sanchez Chrome for the Yankees and the one for Crowder, Tom C. Okay, Will Myers, rookie. Gabe Spire, refractor. Sonny Gray, rookie. Breakouts, Flores, Gibson, Bumgarner, and Singrani. So one out brings up Andrew Alberto. Did it really? Wow. Interesting. Fuentes is, Fuentes is in the Long Island Ducks still. Nice. Still in baseball. Ethan Carnes, another Yankee. 250 for the Yanks. Orange, a green, and a judge. Cole Stewart, Gaither Bumgarner. Great name. Anthony Rendon, rookie. Grant Green, refractor. Were those numbered? Nope. Gibson, there we go. Nolan Arenado, rookie card for the Rockies. Very nice. Jaron, all you, man. Doubt you want to grade a base paper rookie of Nolan. Not sure what those are actually worth. Five, ten bucks, I would guess. Pro far. Brian Hudson, another color. Five hundred for the Sox. Mike Kickham, Gabe Spear. Follow two strikes. Syndergaard first. Ooh, no, Syndergaard was 2011. Andrew Jones, throwback. Blake Taylor, Timmy Anderson, nice Meadows first. Alan Hansen, refractor. We got a Polanco. Go sucky, Kato. <laughs> oh, is the Atlantic League. Fuentes is only 28 years old. Only. Good play. Very nice. Is the Atlanta League not Major League Baseball affiliated or something? Is that what you were saying? Atlantic League, not the Atlanta League. Rowanis, Elias, one more out. Teddy Ball game. All right, Zolio Almonte, Connor Green, nice Pui rookie. Man, I remember breaking cases and cases of this stuff looking for Pui. Keon Braxton. A lot of 13 Bowman. Kevin Gaussman, rookie. Push bun up the first baseline, won a foot race. There's a that fellow that's pretty standard. decent for the Marlins, Yelich. Nice base rookie. The Fish, Ryan A. Nice card, man. 1 0 pitch. I don't know about PSA 10 on that either. I have not looked up Yelich's in a long time. The refractor of Brian Hudson. Looks like we got one more refractor situation. on the bottom of the box here. It's Were you, rookie? Safe. Hell of a year. Hey, man. Finally putting it together. Another nice rookie. L.A. Dodgers, John Y. They don't feel the same, do they? You can tell. Bostic and Hernandez. Castano. We have a Silver Ice. Didi rookie, too. Man, nice. Albert Almora, Silver Ice. Didi and Almora. He's in charge here. Two out. Nobody on. One and two to Oscar Mercado, first chrome. <laughs> Is he really? I didn't know that. Oh, they aren't affiliated. Okay. Mercado. Excellent breakout season with the Indians so far. Brennan Middleton. We got Will Morris, Jake Stone, and Kevin Franklin to close it out. That be it. Here we go. On to draft. Two balls, two strikes, two outs. Flipped it down the line. Foul. Gets a run to that changeup. Well off the outside corner. to get some to chase it. Barely getting a piece. Yep. Do it again here. Two and two. Matches up five two. Two outs. Full count. Alrighty, and this side. Go three balls, two strikes to Braxton. The pitch. Swing and a no, he will not. 
by the final of five to two, their first back to back it's win. Mildly ironic when you think about it. Here. That Mercado wound up having a better major league career than OT already. Time. Nice out Terribly unfortunate, though. Oh. Did not allow a run. Couple of walks, seven strikeouts. Okay, for 14 draft. Jumbo, been a while since we've opened this stuff. A lot of big chromes in here. Get two boxes out. Actually, you know what? We'll do three boxes. Just like we did the last yeah, we're kind of nerding out out here, guys, on the fact that Domingo continues to crush the ball in the opposite field. That is his sixth opposite field home run of the season, and uh, that stat leads Major League Baseball. Excuse me, the American League, I should say. Major League Baseball. Man, as soon as that ball left the bat, just the way that the launch angle went up, I'm thinking, uh, I think he just missed it. Uh -huh. And then this ball just continues to travel. Now take a look at how deep it <sighs> is. There we go. Goes. It does, yeah. About, what, eight, ten rows I mean, down. he was... Amazing. The he reminded me... He was Tavares left-handed or right-handed? His body type kind of reminds me of Juan Soto. Maybe I'm off there. Maybe I don't remember Oscar Tavares, what he actually looked like. Uh, here we go. 14 draft jumbo. Enjoy. Good symmetry. You pitch a man, he can still turn on it. Okay, he, he Mickey Gordon, ball, nice Conforto left first. Center, right center, you got the four home runs there. And Glass again, now, Morgan Almonte, right and that's refractors of Aaron Brown and Mason that Williams. That's where he's hitting the base Big ball. fan of 14 draft, actually. I just forgot how much I like it. It's actually a very nice, clean design this year. Well, 14 Bowman in general. Lamone, Hayter, Gillespie, Kevin Padlow, Silver Ice. First auto, Luke Weaver. Some value with him. St. Louis Cardinals off the skunk board. Cardinals are Parker W. So far for skunks, all we got are the Rangers and now the Cardinals. All the way down on the bottom. Here we go. Keller, Jacoby Jones, Jace Fry, Refractors, Diaz, and Clarkin. And so how much of that, because I think it was four straight hits in the sixth inning, was just some of the fatigue and the mistakes that you guys took advantage of? Minor yeah, league guy. Us, you know, and that inning, you know, and I think he's with he the Marlins now? On, um, Isn't he, Greg? Didn't Corey Ray get traded to the Marlins, or am I thinking of somebody else? I'm thinking of Brinson, aren't I? Opposite field home runs. Do you Hawkins, second-year judge. Nice card. Than any of your other hits? Spanky, Supak, um, and Lively. Yeah, you know, that's my bread and butter. You know, I always try to go I think I'm thinking of Brinson, Greg. And, um, we I can, you know, I just, you know, like I said, I was... Aaron Brown, Mason Williams, Sands, Sands TJ Antone, Nick Howard, Kopech first, you were a master and that, Zimmer and Zimmer Austin Boosfeld. The pitch that Omar hit out of the park, it was so inside. What does he have to do to barrel that one out? Lively Diaz, Clarkin, we got Matt Chapman, Sky Blue, Trey Supak, Green, Supak's out of 150. Tyler Beatty and Taylor Goucher. Yeah, I was definitely thinking of uh, Brinson. Boosfeld, Supak, and David Dahl. Nate, there's your former boy, man. Good times with Jacob Gatewood back in the day. Milwaukee, former top prospect for them. I don't know where he is now. Brad W. Jacob Gatewood's still in the Brewers system. Anybody know? Top of their head. Brewers off the board. Absolutely, because I don't think there's going to be a lot of contenders. Stratton and Morgan. Brian Scales and Roberto Osuna. Yeah. Ah, none of us hit it. None of us bat a thousand, right? I love his discipline at the plate. I love his power. You saw that here tonight. He's handling that inside pitch. But he's also done a nice job behind the plate. Yep. And uh, this is what the Silver Ice, Matty Imhoff. No ink there. Morgan. And, uh, as Dave said, oh, for sure we were going to get some ink. Ryan Yarborough and Tyler Nathan. Gatewood's in double A with the Brewers. I remember he was young in 14, so he actually still may have a shot. Next, you're watching Mariners Post Game presented by Alaska Airlines. Ramos and Binford, and we got Oliver and Devin Travis. Monty Harrison, yep. A little ice here. Cole Stewart, Otto, nope. Tyler Danish, Travis, Blair, Lindgren. Eloy, that's one of the big ones in here. First, Bowman's Eloy, chrome and paper. Happened to spot him there. 
Gonzalez and Thompson. Gatewood is 23. Uh, he still has a shot then. I mean, look, Hunter Dozier is the perfect example there. Long time in the minors. Finally breaks out, what is he, 25, 26 Dozier? Or is he a little older? I can't remember. Lavalle, 150. I guess he hasn't put a full year together too, so we can't really call him a breakout. If he hadn't gotten hurt, maybe we'd have a different opinion. Ronnie Williams and Luis Torrance. Yes. Chavis always had that uh, that Boston connection, though. Well, Luke Weaver. So I think I feel like his card still held a little value. Just because he was in that organization. The Severino or Acevedo? That is Severino. My God, he looks young. Damn. Ortiz, Tyone, Trey Turner first in this too. Jeez, I completely forgot about him. Hoffman, Justin Steele. Hoffman, Steele, well, David Dahl, Ajax, Torres, and Monty. Derek Fisher, David Dahl. Fisher, another first Bowman in here. Oh, let me just put something up. Hunter's 28, so it took him a long time. Some guys don't reach their prime till then, I guess. Just putting something on to dwindle the dwindle the background noise here. Turns 28, okay. Marcus Wilson and Alex Jackson. Man, this would have been a great case back in the day. You got Gatewood already, Luke Weaver, and Alex Jackson. All pretty highly uh, regarded. Jackson was one of the most expensive autos in this. His base autos actually may have touched. Let me just turn this down. His base autos, I, I'm almost positive, were over 100 bucks at one point, Ajax. First Bowman. Last I knew he was with the Braves system. Still there or no? Okay, what do we got? Brewers and Mariners. Mariners are off. Brewers already took off. Okay. Vasquez Anderson and CJ. Bottom refractors, Marcus Wilson, Daniel Robertson. Alex Jackson's only 23. Damn. That's that's good. Is that low enough or is it still super loud? I can barely hear it over here. Definitely sounds like wind chimes though. Good there. Just so there's something in the background, that's all. Okay, Fisher, Dahl, Wilson, Tyler Beatty, CJ and Cusino. Oh, my bad. Coatsart and Swihart. <laughs> is it better now? I turned it like all the way down. Let me know if it's still too loud. I will happily turn it down. Ooh, waves. We got... Damn. We got two silvers and three black waves. That's pretty. Let's just peel those out. Set them right there with a Derek Fisher on the top. Here's the rest of the pack. Hadlow, Hoffman, and Steele. James Ramsey, Silver Ice. A couple nice chromes there. The Refractors. Rayleigh and Brandon Drew. Better now? Okay. I'm going to say I can barely hear it over here. All right, Waves, let's go. Uh, there definitely was not Silver Wave Autos. If there was a Wave Auto, it would be black. Uh, there were Wave Autos this year, Greg. They were numbered uh, very, very low. I think 15 and 10 for blue and black. I remember specifically black waves were out of 15. I can't remember if blues were out of the same or not. Anyways, here we go. Nick Williams for the Rangers. 11 out of 25, Nicky Williams for the Rangers. Silver wave. We got Zach LeMond. Joey Gallo and Grant Hawken. Let's see who our last silver wave is. 
Jackson Reitz, nobody too big. 21 out of 25. So Reitz and Williams, yeah, not big enough to knock him off the skunk board. Making me have seizures. <laughs> Damn wind chimes. Nice judge. Ooh, gold chrome. Hello, gold chrome. I see you. Fetty. Let's see who our gold chrome is. It's a first bowman of Dylan Davis. Dylan Davis. <laughs> Charles. Dylan Davis. <laughs> I almost wish Charles was in here to see this pull. 7 out of 50. I do wish. Dylan Davis, man. Yep. Cole Tucker Auto I pulled for you, Greg. Exactly. I actually thought it was for somebody else. That was the card I was referencing. Though. I think I actually pulled two of those. One for you and one for the Parrish Brothers. Nikki Wells. Nikki Williams. Points! No points. Blue chrome on the way. Nikki Gordon, Conforto, Rhodes, Blue and Blue, Alfaro, and Kopech. Nice card. Boston, 186. Blues were 399 back in 14 draft. My lord. So high on the blues. Bobby Bradley and Sean Coyle. Okay, Lamont, Hader, and Jalaspi. Auto, Cody, Medarios. Milwaukee Brewers, base auto. Brewers were already out with the Gatewood. Make sure I put that in the race stack. Yes. Another nice Judge Chrome, too. And Gossett and Robbie Kaminsky for the two refractors. Red Ice on the way. Nice KB. Red Ice is Colin Moran. 71 out of 150 on the Moran. Shipley and bottom refractors. AJ Reed, Trey Ball. Prince and JD. Winker. Matty I'm home. Please tell me Chad has the Phillies. I have not looked. Phillies, Phillies. Tommy G has the Phillies. Can't complain there. PC for him. Chad's got the Cubs here. Matty Imhoff, first Bowman auto. Sad story with this kid, really, when you actually listen to it and read it. Awful. Absolutely awful what happened to the poor kid. Zagunas into Shields. More points. Okay, McCullers, Brigham and Anderson, Hunter Harvey, Soltis Guerrero, Cameron Varga, Severino, but not his first chrome. Stack of paper to the refractors, Richie and Christian Arroyo. Do do do. Silver Ice Chad Sabatka, that is a nice auto. Holy shiznits. Wow. That one popped right out of nowhere. Verdugo True Blue for LA. Damn, John Y. Grats on that, man. 13 and 14 draft. One of the nicest cards of the break. In its entirety. Beautiful Verdugo Blue. I'm gonna sleeve that in just a second. Anderson, Urias, and Ortiz. Refractors on the bottom, JD, and I bet that's a Bryant. It's a Bryant. Nice refractor. Cubbies for Chadwick. Everybody pass out on the Verdugo Blue. No love for Verdugo. Okay, 115 out of 150. Nice card. John Y. Actually, that's probably going to be great. It's only going to Okay, more packs. Pretty simple. Williamson, Joey G, Valet, nice Lucas Sims, and some Chromes. Fallen Check and Brinson. Verdugo. 
<laughs> no worries. Sederoth, Story, 89, Tyone, Naquin, Arroyo, and Zabunis. Brigham and Anderson. Brad, you need to go to bed, bro. 6.30 tea time, man. Agreed, TD. Agreed. Excellent young player. Just stuck on a team with a plethora of talent. Devin Travis. Talk about a guy that cannot stay healthy. 181 out of 399. Devin Travis. Another contact hitter, but like I said, I don't think he'll ever stay healthy. Holmes and Foley. Dude's made of glass. Who were we talking about earlier? Oh, Greg Bird. Yeah. Greg Bird also made of glass. 60% and rising. Are you like me? If you don't get X amount of sleep, you don't even, like, the alarm does not register. Rymel Tapia. Nice Dylan Overton. Another former Nate PC right there. Overton for the A's. Parker W. That's all you. And that will knock the A's off the skunk board. What was the other auto? The Phillies off the skunk board. I think they were already off. Nope. There they are. And the refractors are Sheffield and Raul Mondesi. Pipeline's backed up. Yep. Not a bad thing. Good thing, really. Yes, did I actually leave the Dodgers on the skunk board? I would have caught that at the end, but yeah, they're they're good. They ain't skunked. Alright, Seeger 89 style throwback, Travis Blair, and refractors are Zach Lamone and Josh Hader. Just maybe. That's a really nice card. Zimmer, Boosfeld, Supak, little Daniel Robertson, Morgan Mazzara, and Pentecost. Nice Eloy. Stuck to Imhoff and took a spill. Still nice and clean, though. Sharp, Eloy first. Go to the Cubbies. Ryan Ripken, Colin Moran. Okay. B.D. Goucher and Zimmer. Garrett Fullencheck. Remember that name. Pulled plenty of him. Fullencheck, first Bowman. Atlanta Braves. If they were on the schneid, they're off. Cole Tucker and Wilson? No, oh, Jared Walker. Oh, there the Braves are. Alright, Scales Osuna, a little mini of Julio, Lindgren, Hansen, and Ramos. Tyler Kolek, Dustin DeMuth. Ah, they, they expired June 30th? Jesus. Who are the redemptions that you can remember off the top of your head? I'm trying to think. 17 UFC Chrome. Mark Hunt was definitely a redemption. Was Ariani a redemption in 17? Dylan Davis, Silver, Ramos, Benford, Strahan, Stratton. Matty Imhoff, Jesse Winker. Nunez and Sil. Yeah, man, and Nunez. The good thing about that is, though, Nate, they do honor them. I mean, they really do. I know I say it a lot, but we've had really good luck. Even stuff as far back. I told you guys about the Ryu Super tonight. Had really good luck with it. It doesn't mean they have to honor him on anything specific, but I'm sure they have Amanda Nunez's auto sitting there. Cody Reed. Ooh, big card for the Cubbies right there. That's nice. That'll knock the Cubs off the schneid. Eloy Refractor. That is definitely 20 bucks plus. Especially graded. Chad, if you want to, just let me know, man. We can PSA that. Get a nice 10, hopefully. Bump the value considerably. That one's honestly sharp enough for BGS. Yeah, so basically you fill out the back. I have a guy, I have a tops rep that I actually do. I would, if you guys have any, I would mail them to me and just have me do them. I think you'll have better odds that way. Castellani for the Rockies. But uh, if you want to do it yourself, you just fill out the back and mail it in. 
Or you can email support and wait for them to write back to you and then do it that way. That might be better just so you have a record of it. Two thousand ten Strasbourg, I don't think you're getting lucky with that, man. Yeah, that's probably not gonna not gonna get fulfilled. Ajax, Freed, and Spencer Adams, who's stuck to somebody here. JP Crawford. The refractors are Blewett and Almora. Third of the way through the 18 draft picks. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, yeah. Whoo, boy, Chad, heating up with the Cubbies, man. Eloy's on fire right now. Even he's always a White Sox. Nice silver ice first and a chrome first of Eloy. Okay, Lavalley, Howard, Lane, and Kopeck, and Refractor, Stinnett, and Reese McGuire. One more stack. We'll do another three box lot here. F. Chad. Really? Which one was it? Oh, Penn and Silva Dual Auto. True, Nate. Very true. And he's playing pretty damn well for the for the White Sox right now. Shane Zeal lost to Meadows. Nice refractor there on the Meadows. Not his first, though. Okay, next three boxes. Was the Eloy trade the year the Cubs won the World Series? So by trading them effectively, I mean, obviously not. Obviously they won the World Series, but that was the year they got Quintana. I can't remember if that was the year they won or was that the following year when they didn't win. So my point being, if they traded Eloy that year that they won the World Series, definitely worth it. If it was the following year when they made that playoff run and lost, then probably not so much, not so much worth it. I just can't remember if it was uh, the same year or not. There we go, mix it up. There's three more boxes. It was the following year. I thought it was. I didn't think Quintana was on the World Series team. Sixteen was the World Series, right? Okay, Rhodes, Twine, Herrera, and Sparks. A little mini of Correa, Morgan Almonte, Rush, and Refractors. Nice Schwarber. More love for Chad. A little Schwarber first. Damn, so they gave up a beast in Eloy Jimenez and did not win a second World Series. That stinks. Well, I guess it doesn't sting too bad yet. Another Eloy. Lot of Eloy. That is the second Chrome and third or fourth first. Kevin Padlow. That's a Rockies. 150. A couple more Chromes and our two refractors. Spencer Turnbull having a very nice season for Detroit. And Eric Jagalo. Of course, he's still on Detroit, though. Cubs were 16. Ah, yeah. Astros 17. How could I forget? Boston. Looks like Nick Gordon. No, Jack Flaherty. Damn, another nice auto. 14 drafts, a damn good case so far. Name value. Flaherty. Hey, he'd have a much better record. <laughs> Three and six with Detroit, but man. Look at his uh, ERA and whip. Oh, you probably know it. Being a Tigers fan, all good. Cardinals, Jack Flaherty. We had a Luke Weaver to go with him, too. He's got the Cardinals this case. Parker W., nice card, man. Flaherty and Weaver. Weaver was having a very nice season until he got hurt. Derek Hill, Corey Ray. True, they did have... Yeah, they had Happ and Schwarber. True. Back then, tough to gauge, but I, I think the beast that he's turned into, I think they're going to regret that one long term. But 
got to do what you got to do when you're in the race, man. Gettys and Nemo. He, I think just his last start, I, I have him in fantasy leagues, that's the only reason I know. His last start he got rocked, but before that he had a nice six inning gem. So, I'm hoping it was just a bad start against Cleveland. He's got him again, I think, either tomorrow or the day after. Castellani, Dom Smith. Just wish they would give him some damn run support. Still, 70 plus strikeouts though for him. Should hit the 100 mark soon. Nice KB there. Mr. Bryant, Wells, Williams, nice Verdugo. First Bowman, Silver Ice. Solid. Just remembered how hot Bryant stuff is right now with his recent streak. Castellani, Dom Smith, and Connor Joe. And refractors of Poppy and Bell. Gomber, Feliz, and Reed. Little Ice O'Brien. Autograph of Matty Why wouldn't we get two on Rookie P400? Tommy G. Nostalgia, my friend. I'm Hoff Refractor, first Bowman. Got a base to go with it, too. Jake Reed, Schwarber, and Stokes. Taekwon Forbes. Nice Devers first. I may have forgot the Devers first was in this. Good stuff. Way off center, though, for the Sox. Those should be making a run pretty soon. Bell stuff is pretty massive, but it wasn't his first, Nate. I wouldn't feel right doing a second year chrome to knock somebody off the, the skunk board. Nice Conforto first. Jordan Montgomery Ice. No ink here. Geller. Jones. Fry. Glass now. Newcomb and Jake Reed. I don't even remember what year Josh Bell's first chrome was. Maybe 2013? Is it 13? I can't remember now. That Devers might be over 10 bucks, really. Refractor first, the season he's having. Garcia, very nice. Nola, and he shaves. Damn. 14 draft is definitely the best name value case of the night so far. Nice Nola silver ice to go with it. Big Boston hit. Were they off the board already? I think they were. No, they weren't. Nice card. Bell's seven bucks. Hey, it's not too far off ten, dude. Good guess, anyways. Nice hit for Boston. Just need some more low numbered color now. Kopech, Freed, Adams, and Connor Joe and Braden Shipley. Pretty sure I already went through the stack. Yeah, that was the middle base. Dropped it when I saw the Shavis. We can keep it up here. Sky Blue, Demetri, $4.99. There's a Crohn's. Landino and Mark Appel. Yeah, they're going to have one hell. Oh, just shy for Devers. All right. I was close. They're going to have one hell of a pitching staff soon. Like, they better fix their offense. Weaver, Snow, or else all those arms are just going to go to waste, man. Birdie and Irvin. Assuming they can stay healthy, of course. Okay, Peraza, Lamone, and Hader. First Bowman, the wrong Cub. Mark Sagunas, 95 out of 399. Ah, yeah. V Martin, Miggy. When did those go? Nice Judge Chrome there. Refractos. Nice Weaver. Nice to know. Very nice Weaver. Can't imagine you got too much time left on Martinez. 2083. <laughs> So really, they just need to expand their payroll then and suck it up. Hunter Harvey, green for the O's out of 150. Brett Graves and Dummerit.
Flaherty first. Clint Frazier. DeMuth. Tucker and Walker. Another nice Eloy. And we got a Sutter off and a Trevor Story. Definitely. He may just be too old to get healthy, though. Dozier, Gatewood, Berrios. Another Berrios there. No ink. Sims, Griffin, Correa. Honeywell and Lorenzen. Definitely. True Blue Chrome on the way. Actually, I don't need to say True Blue because there weren't any Wave Blues back then. Jose Peraza. 111 out of 399 for the Braves. Fetty and Padlo. Less eating out. There you go. Who wants to do that, though? Little mini Jeff Hoffman. Scoglin, Barreto, and Mata. Freeland, Schwartz. All right, 14 draft. A little autoless dry streak here. Let's take the socks off the board since they hit that Chavis. Or Chavis. I know, I've been saying it wrong all those years. Ramsey, Davis, Tapia, and that looks like Spencer Howard. Nope, Nick Birdie. Close. Birdie for the Twins. And the Twins go off the board. Gatto, Cato, and Renfro. And we got Austin Dakar and Corey Seager. Twenty twenty three, that's not too bad then. Should be a rival time for all your pitchers. Andrew Morales, DeMuth, Tucker, Walker, Zeal. Well, they'll probably be there before then, actually. Jalaspi and Gordon, but that's definitely not that bad then, at least. Maybe he'll get his knee fixed, man. I feel like he was such a good hitter he could still be effective into his late age, as long as he's healthy. Ooh, nice Reese. Damn, that is pretty right there. That Tommy G? That is Tommy G. Tommy, let me know if you want to try grading that. Look at the centering on that. That is perfect, bro. Hoskins first refractor. That's got to be over 10 bucks. I'd be shocked if it wasn't. Those things spiked like crazy at one point when he first came up. I'm sure they kind of settled back down. Nice Hoskins, though. First Bowman. Okay. Here we go. Red ice on the way. Ice, ice is Braxton Davidson out of 150 for the Braves. Mater and Cato. Seventeen on Comsi. Boom. Nate, remember when they were like forty to fifty bucks? Ooh, Green Auto, Braxton Davidson. Somebody say earlier he's still in the Brave system at 23, or was that Alex Jackson? I can't remember. I feel like Braxton might have gotten traded. Green first Bowman Auto, though. Nah, 82 out of 99, sorry. Atlanta Braves. They were already off the board. That was Ajax, okay. Nice clean auto on the Braxton. A lot of hype with him when this stuff came out, and it immediately died down. Nice Chavis. Cole Stewart. Clapped was Jackson. Trevor Story, Grenier, Naquin, Richie, and Arroyo, and we got a Braxton and an Alfaro. Blue coming up, Flaherty, Peraza, Non Auto, Austin Boosfeld. It'll be 399. Refractors. Griffin. Nice Correa. Braxton. Okay, Braxton is with Atlanta still. Double A. Alright. Alright. 
Flaherty, nice silver ice first. Renato Nunez, die cut. Valet and DJ Peterson. Yes. <laughs> yes, it was. And he he was in the whammy, uh, he was in whammy status for so many years, too. Magically removed himself from it. Nice Joey Gallo refractor there on the bottom. Nice Hoskins first again. Derek Fisher, another solid auto. Very impressed with our 14 draft case so far. Astros off the board. There they are. Derek Fisher, Mike O, that's all you, man. First Bowman, clean. Seal Meadows and Stanett. And we got refractors of Grenier and Mac Williamson. Still have two and a half boxes left for the first leg of the draft. Another auto, Jacob Lindgren. There we go. Harvey Wall and Sims. Yankees, Jacob Lindgren. Unfortunately, not a big name. Force Wall first, Lucas Sims. Yankees are off the board, though. <laughs> yeah, right, man? Nice Aranola first. Matty Chapman, another solid name. 14 draft delivers over and over again. Parker W, nice card, man. A lot of guys were always big on Matt Chapman. First Bowman auto. Did they have an auto yet? I don't see him on the board, but they're off, so they must have. Matt Chapman first. Spencer Turnbull first. Scogland and Barreto on the refs. Holmes, Foley, Medarios, and Freeland. Nice Devers first. Oh, big, big pinholes in the chrome, unfortunately. That sucks. All right, Jonathan Holder and a Buxton on the bottom. Sit up and fix the chair. Just a quick stretch. Still got lots of draft to go. Although, thank God we got the Super Jumbos at the end. Because like I said earlier, those are much easier and much quicker. Okay. Ripken, Moran, Sheffield, Trey Turner. Another Eloy. Dylan Cease and McMahon. I don't even want to think about how cheap our Mercados finally or probably sold at call up. We had a ton of them, and I'm sure we had them way too low. Sean Reed Foley, Hunter Hard. Alex Gonzalez, no auto. Skoglin, Cato, Gatto, and Renfro at the bottom. Purple Ice. God, I really wish they'd bring back the Ices. They were so fun. Taekwon Forbes at a 99. Texas Rangers. Taekwon. Taylor Sparks and Lance McCullers. Polish this off and get to the final two boxes in the draft. Seeger and Hart. Got an Eric Fetty auto for the Nationals. Takes them off the skunk board. Fetty. Could have learned to sign a little better, Fetty. Justin Twine, Roselle Herrera, last pack here. Hoskins first once again. Robbie Kaminsky, Meadows, Stanette, McGuire, Blewett. Conforto and Rhodes. Conforto's a beautiful refractor. Beautiful. New York Mets. Andy... Who wants to price check 14 Chrome Conforto Refractor on Com C? Anybody? 
Okay, we got two boxes left. We gotta mark the. We just got an auto, the Nationals. Oakland A's were already off. Okay. Oh, it's. I mean, look. Unless you're watching games and you're and you're watching all the all the minor league games and like the majority of the major league games every uh, every night, then yeah, it is tough. I agree. I used to be much more knowledgeable than I am now. Although this year I have really forced myself to get back into it. Like I got the MILB subscription. I watch a ton of minor league games, even if they're only highlights here and there. Watch a ton of Major League Baseball, more than I have ever watched, probably in the last three years, I would say. But it's just something I enjoy being knowledgeable about, and I enjoy watching the game, so just had to get back into it. <laughs> yeah, man. Hey, sometimes you got to take the money when it's hot, man. Alonzo could easily come back down to earth. Another auto, Kyle Freeland, solid Major Leaguer, not having a good year, though. I guess I could say he's a solid major leaguer last year. Freeland for the Rockies, first Bowman. Five autos remain. Verdugo first, Refractor, and Peter O'Brien. Only two bucks on the Conforto. Why did I think he was much higher than that? I think I know the answer, and I think his name is Peter Alonzo. Mets fans are uh, starry-eyed over him right now. Nice Nola. Boy, we are really hitting some nice first refractors. These are all a lot of solid cards. Like you guys have seen the values in the chat. Anywhere from 2 bucks, 5 bucks, 10 bucks, 18 I think you guys said for that Hoskins first. Hoffman. Not a true auto, though. Crawford. Nice judge again. Cody Medeiros and Brett Martin. Now yeah, we'll set those on the side. True blue Conforto first for 20 bucks. That is cheap. I would have thought it was more. Another Eloy Chrome for Chad. Jackson Reitz, Silver Ice, Corey Ray, and Blandino. Jackson Reitz and Hunter Dozier. Amazing. It really is amazing. All right, here we go. Blue Chrome could be a big boy. Gomber, Fleas. Boosfeld, non-auto, Cusino. Austin Boosfeld, Austin Cusino. Well, that was a wah, wah, wah. Schwarber first. Luplo and Blackburn. Yeah, I hate Shimmers and Mojos. I despise them. I wish they would just bring back Waves. Uh, make a sepia par parallel, stick with it. Make a black that they do every year at the same number, 99. Quit changing it every year. But my wishes are uh, of no concern to them. Oh, Pentecost had, uh, had Schwarber colors there on the side. Out of baseball, Max Pentecost. Toronto Blue Jays. They get a hit. Refractor Auto Pentecost. So the Rockies and the Jays need to come off here. 14 drafts spreading the love here. Shipley, Weaver, Sano. We got Dylan Davis and Rhyme out. <laughs> yeah. Lots of people will argue there's no difference, but I mean, it's it's obvious. There's a lot of people that just don't get it, man. They just don't get that traditional colors are what the majority of collectors want, so there's more demand, therefore it doesn't matter if the supply is the same as a wave. There's more demand and they're both limited to 50, just using a gold as an example. Very, very simple concept and there's a lot of people that will argue until you're blue in the face that it should be the same, worth the same, but it, it just doesn't make any sense. Nimmo! Little Refractor, Andrew Morales, Josh Hart. Yeah, they just see the 25. They're like, oh, it's number to 25. Why isn't it the same? It's like, because it's not a traditional color. And they're like, well, that's stupid. That doesn't make any sense. I'll just buy the shimmers. 
Just one of those things. Eventually, it'll level out. Trevor Story, Red Ice, out of 150. 10 out of 150. I mean, if that was the case, why would a Panini Auto out of 25 not be the same as a Bowman Auto, or at least in the same, same ballpark, you know? They understand that, but they don't understand Shimmer versus True. I have a feeling, though, in a few years, they're just going to keep making the Shimmers. I mean, they will gain popularity, and they'll probably sell okay in the end. There we go. Orange Ice. Little Nola first. It's not been the cards. Montgomery in the orange. Gosaki. Kato. 3 out of 25. Decent card. Values are actually coming back for this kid. If anybody can believe that. He was in the toilet for what? Five years? Three years? Four years? Somewhere in there. Nice orange. Not good enough to knock the Yanks off the board, but they were already off the board. Nice Devers first. Chapman first. Frazier first. For the Refractors. I, I think he must have eaten a couple sandwiches because he was putting up some pretty gaudy numbers at the beginning of the year. Nice Dozier. Mickey Gordon, one of the top names in this when that came out. Imagine he's still with the Twins. Nate, you probably know. Chris Well, all you, man. Mickey Gordon. Refractors of Flaherty. Very nice card. And Lucas Chilito. Ripken and Moran. Back tightening up. Poppy and Bell. Gatewood and Jose Berrios. Yeah, don't you love that? What I love is when you're trying to search sold listings on eBay now, uh, they added this stupid feature where you can promote an active listing when somebody's searching for a sold listing. So anytime I'm looking up comps, I go to sold listings, and I gotta filter through like three or four active listings. eBay, man. eBay. Josh Moran and Miguel Almonte. Actually, Josh Morgan, not Moran. Nice. Still young enough to uh, produce at some point. $3.99. Wow, we hit the Manziel. Oh my god, I forgot all about this card. <laughs> he actually has autographed copies in here. If you can believe it, fellas. We pulled a couple of them. That is the, That might be the variation Manziel. It's definitely the refractor version at minimum. San Diego Padres. Man. He killed the hobby single-handedly. 14 tops chrome football bombed because of this fella. Preston, that's all you, man. Funny-ass card, Manziel. Refractor. They were selling for asinine amounts of money when those came out. And, uh, yeah, they bombed, of course, as many of you guys know. Uh, let's grab a couple more papers out here to make some room. Uh, it just does that for some cards, Greg. I don't honestly know the criteria for why it does that. we got a Refractor Auto coming up. That looks like a friggin' Manziel. That looks like a Manziel. Has the exact same look as the Refractor we just pulled. Let's find out. Maybe it is, maybe it's not. It is not. It's Michael Geddes, so it's Padres, so that's what threw me. But, it's Padre, Michael Geddes. Padres off the schneid. And a whole slew of Trey Turner first Bowmans, too. Decent break for the Padres. I wonder what the hell that Manziel's worth now. Probably more than I would think. Keller and Jacoby Jones. Uh, Padres gone. Is there an auto before that I forgot? Twinkies, Nick Gordon. Already had them all. Franimal would have been nice, yeah. Oh, Redemption. It's probably going to be a Nola. Zimmer. And. Oh, my God. If this is Nola, this is going to sting. Tommy G, I will do my best to get you this card if it is a Nola. Let's see who else it could be. It's not a Nola. It's a Ryan Ripken. That was a short print. Ripken had no base. He only had color. 
I think that's what it was. It was either no base or no refractors. At least it wasn't an holo, because that would have stung. It's a couple hundred dollar card now, probably. Ripken Blue. Uh, that was the Baltimore Orioles. Who has the Orioles? Andy. We'll still send that in for you. Maybe we'll get lucky and get it. Can't imagine there was a high demand for Ryan Ripken autos. Chrome Draft Pick Blue. I'm not going to knock you off the skunk board for that either. So, Ryan Ripken. Okay, Milton Ramos and Benford and Strahan. Varga and Severino. Alright, first leg of draft. Almost completed. I think we have two autos left. At least one, possibly two. And now less, because here's an auto. Bradley Zimmer. Decent. Menzel Base Refractor is $21. That is insane. It was highly short printed, the base. I assume the refractor is highly short printed too. Indians are off the board. Blair, Lindgren, and Hansen. And we got refractors of Casey Soltis and Gilly Guerrero. Okay, Gonzalez, Thompson, we got a Hunter Renfo, Ellis, Danish, and Travis. Brett Austin, Courtney Hawkins. Oh, yeah, he probably wasn't logged in, so it didn't show the shipping there. Either way, that's amazing. Chavis first, Urias, Ortiz, Tyone. That's a judge. Yankees, Grant Hawkins on top. Nice Judge Refractor, second year Chrome. Yanks were already off the skunk board. That's a nice one. Yankees are Crowder Man. Let me know what you want to do with that, Crowder. Just Com C, possibly. Try for that 10. Alright, Joey G, Foley, DeShields, AJ Reed, Trey Ball, and Blake Anderson. Spencer Adams and J.P. Crawford. Wow, really? I don't ever... I never saw the Johnny Baseball one. Well, to be fair, I don't remember. I remember I pulled maybe one or two. I have no friggin' clue. <laughs> I, I would like to say I remember the inscriptions, but I don't. I very well may have pulled one. I have no freaking idea. Let me see Lloyd first again. Refs, Kopak, Freed. Okay, I like that. I think I'm going to start saying refs for refractors. Is that too toolsy? Uh, no, they can't because they're a consignment business, Nate. Uh, collectors will always want to have cards in hand if they're their big cards. Nobody's going to send them, you know, a $100,000 collection to sell. I'm sure there are people that do that, but it's not commonplace. Alex Blandino for the Cincinnati Reds. It's just better than saying refractors, Greg. That's all it is. It's quicker. I promise I'm not trying to be a douche. Howard and Lane Thomas. Two packs remain in the first half. This should be the longest half. Super Jays up next. Or not half. Leg, I should say. Oh, we got a Swihart, Gossett, Kaminsky, Bobby B. Pentecost and LaValle. I don't honestly know, Nate. I, eBay would be fine if they revised their returns. The returns are just ancient for sports cards. They just, they gotta do it. You have to understand it's a volatile market and prices change every week. You can't have these garbage automatic returns two months out. Guy breaks his leg. Somebody can return a $5,000 Chrome auto. It's absurd. There's 14 draft in the books, everybody. Quick recap right now. Okay, 
Autograph recap on our 14 and 13 draft. The Blandino for the Reds. Zimmer for the Indians. Ripken Blue. Andy, I'll see what I can do, man. I'll send it in and maybe we'll get lucky and they'll send it out to you. Decent card anyways, Ripken Blue. Getty's Refractor for the Padres. Gordon for the Twins. Penty for the Jays. Freeland for the Rockies. Fetty for the Nats. Chapman for the A's. Lindgren for the Yankees. Fisher for the Astros, Braxton for the Braves, Birdie, Twins, Chavis, nice auto for the Red Sox, Matty Imhoff, Refractor for the Phillies, Flaherty for the Cardinals, best card in the case by far, Verdugo Blue, beautiful card, John Y, probably want to grade that, I'll set it aside, let me know if you don't want to, go BGS on it, Castellani for the Rockies, Fullencheck, Braves, Overton A's, another Matty Imhoff for the Phils, Medeiros for the Brewers, Ajax, for the M's, Gatewood Brewers, Luke Weaver, and the two 13 hits were a Travis Demonite and a Raymond Fuentes out of 99. That was the Padres. And there we go. On to the next leg. 15 and 16 draft coming right up. Not even going to take a break. Just going to move it on the side. Slap a label on. Okay, that was 14. No, that was 13 and 14. Okay, just got to label it for two go. Okay, rocking and rolling. Let me just switch up the screen, add the skunks to the skunk log, and then we got 15 and 16 Super J. A lot of autos, much quicker pace on these, less boredom. But it's also 2.30 in the morning, and I think most of you guys are going to be asleep soon. Okay, Mets, Royals, and O's. Not really a true skunk. A lot of Conforto for you, Andy, so you actually did pretty damn well there. Okay, San Fran, let's see, Giants were Charles. White Sox, Tigers, Sean. Pittsburgh, why can I not see them? They should be right there, Brett Y. Oh, we gotta save this too. 